Hi, I'm Aina Rush from Rush Golf and the Golf Posture Pod. The main reason we developed the Golf Posture Pod was to try and give golfers a feel and feedback for staying in posture. This is the most common swing fault in golf, is loss of posture, particularly in the downswing. So on TV every weekend, if you look at the tour players, what they'll do, they'll get into the golf posture, create nice angle at address, they'll wind to the top of the backswing, but they keep those angles pretty stable all the time. A lot of amateurs will start to stand up at the top of the backswing. And on the downswing, the really good tour players will keep those angles or maybe even go down slightly. They have the little sit down type effect. So it's a very powerful athletic type motion. So their hips are sitting down, they're staying in posture, their lower body is rotating left of the target line, the trunk is rotated left of the target line, and they come into a very strong dynamic position. Amateurs do the complete opposite. They get to the top of their backswing and their hips drive up to the golf ball and their spine backs up. So they lose a lot of hip rotational speed, a lot of trunk rotational speed, and it's typically a, a weak shot. So they lose all their mechanical advantage to create speed and power and to be consistent. This is why we developed the, the posture pod, to try and give golfers a feel for trying to replicate that motion a little bit more closely. Um, right now, usually golf pros will use like golf bags or chairs to try and give golfers a feel for that. But there's no feedback. So if there's no feedback, how do you know that you're really rehearsing the motion correctly? So with the golf posture pod, it's a pad here that's movable. So as I push back on the pad, you'll see the numbers on the screen are going to change. So as I get into my golf posture, I'm going to create an angle with the pad. And my goal is to try to keep that angle pretty stable. So if I wind to the top of my backswing and I stand up, the numbers will decrease. On my downswing, if I stay in my posture or increase my angle a little bit, the numbers will increase. And that's what better players will do. They will increase their number on the downswing. Most amateurs will stand up and the numbers will decrease. So now I can see in real time what exactly I'm doing and what I have to do to make the correct motion. For more tips, go to golfposturepod.com.